Hello and welcome back to a brand new season of Thread Sketching in Action. I'm Deborah Wursu of DebraWursu.com. This first thread sketch for the new year features, as you can see, a tree. It is inspired by a photograph of a tree I took in a local park, but I think my very recent trip to China, where it was midwinter, has influenced the design. This certainly, to me, seems to have a very slight Asian design look to it. The piece began with some hand-painted fabric and applique, to which I then added stitch detail on the trunk to give it texture. The stitched effect chosen to create the gnarled old tree look came about in rather a strange way. As you can see, I began by sketching some erasable guide marks, meaning to suggest pine needles, which I then chose to completely ignore. I have decided that, if there is one thing that I am an expert at, it is changing my mind as I proceed through the creation of a new work. But you know, I think that's one of the beauties and delights of thread sketching and thread painting, as you have the freedom to allow your ideas to go in whatever direction you want them to. The China trip I mentioned, from which I have just returned, was part of my other career hat of being a musician, as I was on tour with the Melbourne Opera Orchestra. We were very busy and had little time for sightseeing, but we did manage to squeeze in some short excursions and explorations, from which I have collected dozens of inspirational photos to use in my artwork. Being away from my sewing machine for a couple of weeks was both refreshing and frustrating. Coming home to it was like reacquainting with an old friend. But, returning to the task in hand here, rather than me chatter on, I chose a limited colour palette of blues, greys and black. All the fabric was hand-painted and three shades of grey and black thread were used for the tree. In designs like this one, I prefer not to add too much quilting detail in the background, as I feel it detracts from the main elements of the picture. So the sky here is only moderately stitched, outlining and highlighting the main features of the sky. Once complete, I think the limited colour palette creates a really pleasing effect. Before I finish up today, I need to announce that the Thread Sketching in Action video demonstrations will be produced every two weeks from now on, rather than weekly. The reality is that I, like all artists, have to earn a living, and these videos take quite a while to produce but I will definitely continue to produce them fortnightly, so I hope you stay with me and support my little business as it grows. There will be many other videos, tutorials, designs and other offerings coming online during the course of the year. Thanks for watching and I look forward, as always, to your company next time. Please visit my website at deborahwursu.com for more tips, tutorials, patterns and videos.